Yeah, it's been a step up for sure. I think um, the biggest challenge is, or the biggest adjustment, I guess, is the fact that uh, you know you're backing up um, day to day. It's, it's there's no big session and then a day off or so. So it's um, certainly uh, in and out every day. Um, it's, it's been an adjustment physically, um, and obviously the skill stuff as well has you know, opened up my eyes to a few things that probably need to work on a little bit to um, you know make sure I'm up to this level consistently. Yeah, I've moved around a little bit, um, sort of found my feet at outside centre up in Sydney for the last couple of years, but finished the year at 12 and uh, and sort of when I was a bit younger, coming through some teams, just playing on the wing um, a bit more. So reasonably comfortable um, to, to sort of cover where, wherever the opportunity comes up, really. But um, uh, yeah, it's probably some more specific skill stuff uh, to cover on the wing that I need to top up on um, if I'm going to be in a sort of super rugby level for that. Yeah, definitely. I think there's there's so much opportunity for for players to there's a couple of spots up for grabs. So that's probably why there's been so much competition out in the field so far. So yeah, no, it's it's really exciting, and I think we off the back of a good year last year. Hopefully, keep that momentum going. Yeah, I suppose next week we'll get all the Wallaby guys back, so that'll be that'll be good. Probably the only benefit to not going well at the World Cup was get them back a bit earlier. So that'll definitely be good to have all those guys back and uh, have the full squad back.